In Swiss machining, we try really hard to do everything we can complete off the machine without having secondary operations. Sometimes, in some features, we need an extra ability to put a cross hole in or put a scallop or some type of key seat feature in the part, and we haven't been able to do it, causing us to send the parts to a secondary operation. Well, we just got a new tool that I'm gonna show you that is helping us eliminate that and allow us to do more things on our Swiss Complete. Check this out. In some instances, we run into our customers will need a, in this case, a scallop or a slot or a cross hole put into the part, which in our Swiss application needs to be done on the backside. Before, we'd either send that to a secondary operation or ask the customer for a deviation. In this case, could we put a pocket in there instead of a scallop? Well, we recently finally took the plunge and made an investment on our machines to be able to do what the customer wanted on the machine. And this is a cross drilling milling spindle attachment for our Swiss legs. Now these are extremely expensive, much the reason why we haven't had one up to this point, but so far it's been a great add-on to this machine. Because these are so expensive, I dragged my feet for a lot of years before I was saying it was time to get one of these. We did some shopping around, got with our machine manufacturer rep, Got quotes from them first, holy crap. Got with some other companies, uh, Gen Swiss and some other North American companies that have them. They're all about the same price. Until I ran into a company at actually one of the last trade shows I went to uh, called TTC North America. Never heard of them before, but they insisted they had all the attachments and all the tools that we needed for our Swiss legs. And sure enough, they had one of these, they had it in stock, and it was less than half of the price of any other brand that I had quoted out. I typically don't like to buy the cheapest thing available, but at this point with the cost that we were talking about for this unit, we had to try it. In short, the cross milling spindle that we purchased from TCC North America has been fantastic. No complaints so far. It meshed into the machine just like they said it would. It's machining all the features that we need to do, leaving good finishes, being able to push it just as hard as any other spindle. I probably shouldn't have been such a tight wad and I should have pulled the trigger on one of these a long time ago. Because ultimately, being able to do these features complete in this machine versus sending parts to secondary operations easily pays for having this unit inside this machine. I'm still gonna be a tight wad though. I, I don't know how to get around that. That's just who I am. It's a part of who I am. So until next time, we'll see what happens.